Hundreds of Edmontonians turn out for the Walk for Valor Saturday, supporting Valor Place, a one-of-a-kind facility that will house injured soldiers and their families. People get sick or injured, they, their rehabilitation goes so much better when their loved ones are by their side and, and are staying with them. And this is the, this is the gap. We, we haven't been able to provide this for them. 700 people showed up for the walk, but organizers say they were only expecting around 200. Construction has already began on the facility, which will allow soldiers to stay with their families while undergoing medical treatment. The 12 suite, 10,000 square foot facility is the first of its kind, says military veteran Hans Brink. There's nothing of its kind for soldiers in Canada right now. They're being put in hotels, etc. But you take a look at Compassion House, you take a look at Ronald McDonald House. Uh, being with your family is part of the healing process. Valor Place is also a registered charity and has raised almost seven of their $10 million goal. Today's walk raised $40,000 alone. The Alberta government has also contributed $1 million to the cause, which MLA Doug Horner says they were proud to do. In my past capacity as the Minister Liaison to the Canadian Forces, we helped develop some state-of-the-art facilities at the Generals that will be uh, there for, for years to come that will help soldiers get back on their feet and it's good to have the family next to it. The facility will also be available for other veterans as well as injured RCMP officers and their families. Doors could open on the complex as early as spring 2012. Get what I need to have happen! Reporting for the Edmonton Sun, I'm Allison Sauls.